Good morning. Uh, it's a snowy Sunday outside and uh, for our blog, uh, Adventures in Music, um, I've decided to try something uh, slightly new today, um, which is to turn, uh, turn it into a bit of a vlog for the day. Um, so although you'll still find some, uh, some written word um, on the blog, uh, some of it's going to be, uh, yeah, this. You and me and a guitar, um, and uh, um, what I'm going to be doing uh, is to carry on uh, what I started last week, um, which is to tell you a little bit about uh, the album, how we made it, um, the lyrics, um, a little bit about how it, the, the song was written, um, how we recorded it, and... Uh, um, some things that you might find interesting to go along with the album, which of course out on February the 1st. Um, and uh, so I'm going to start today uh, with Favourite Son, the uh, fourth track, uh, fifth track on the, um, uh, on the album. And that one started um, in the studio. Uh, we'd been rehearsing. Uh, oh, I think it was probably in about uh, um, February of last year, of 20, uh, 2020. And um, Rob and I were just uh, doodling around, um, uh, thinking about songs and everything. And I found one and it went... <laughs> sounds quite good um, yes I like that um, and that's how how that song started um, and uh, then you have to start and think well what goes with that so um, again because I was down here um, uh, right at the end of the neck I thought well because um, you're basically picking up the minor chord there so come back so that's how the uh, that's how the verse uh, came in and then words uh, what was I going to think about um, and I remember the conversation uh, that I'd had with uh, with Raz um, a few weeks previously, um, I was kicking around a title, Favourite Son, and Raz said, that's me. Oh, well, really? And we sort of discussed it a little bit more. Um, I've got to be honest with you. If you're looking for deep meaning in the lyrics of, of Favourite Son, I think maybe that may be pushing it a little bit too far. Um, I don't think it's really there. But... Certainly, uh, it's a uh, it's a lot of people, a lot of the people who who've listened to it so far of the album, um, uh, think that it's uh, uh, it's one of the strongest songs on it, and uh, I'd have to say that we had a lot of fun with it. I remember on one occasion um, we were we were rehearsing it um, before uh, before we recorded it. And for some reason, and I don't know why, <laughs> I just kept on playing and playing the solo. I think instead of, it actually, the solo goes through um, one verse, um, uh, the bridge, uh, and then the, uh, 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 and then the chorus. That's, that's how it's structured. Um, and I think I went through it about twice. 
Um, I was just going crazy up here on the end of it. <laughs> And just uh, just going mad on it, uh, uh, just around the, the top of the neck on the uh, on the Gibson, um, and we finished it. And Rob had actually recorded it, and uh, he said uh, he said afterwards, "Well, that was very long. It was nine minutes that we played it." And he said, three and a half minutes is a long time to go without words." Um, and uh, yeah, so we cut it down a little bit. It's still actually uh, six minutes and 48 seconds, so probably a little bit too long um, ever to come out as a single. Uh, but I hope you enjoy it because it's, uh, uh, as I say, it, 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 it's something which is very, very close to our hearts. Favourite song.